Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Coffee with Z. We're in central London at the moment. Check out the beautiful properties. And these are the people, think properties that people aspire to get. Obviously, we have to have the Lamborghini here. As you know, I love branding. And this is what we're going to be all about property investment and how can you save money on stamp duty land tax when you buy your main home. Right, now let's get into it. As I said on the intro about stamp duty land tax, things that you need to think about when you buy your main house. And many people make these errors because they don't get the advice. A Couple of things I wanna blurt out straight away is, has the property got an annex? Because there's a special relief that you can take advantage of. It's called multiple dwellings relief and you can take advantage on when you buy your main residence. But you need an evaluation. Does it meet the rules and criteria? Because HMRC have got tough on this. The other bit is a bit different is if you're not buying your main residence and you're buying a property that's probate to buy it and then sell it, you can get pay stamp duty at 0%. And a special criteria, I would look at this. We did a, a quite excessive uh, LinkedIn post blog on this recently. And this is really useful reliefs that you can take for advantage of for stamp duty land tax. The other one, which is a bit more complicated is, if you buy a property and it is not habitable, is therefore stamp duty can be reduced from paying the surcharge and the basic stamp duty for residential to commercial rates. That is huge, but please, please do get an evaluation because our friends HMRC have won a case recently on this and they've become a lot more stricter. You love, don't you love central London, right? Beautiful. And these are the kind of properties you've got to think about when you're buying these kind of how, um, houses and making sure you get them tax efficiently. And this is why you check out our guides, connect with us and make sure you get all the information and then you can make a better decision and hopefully save yourself some money in your pocket. Thank you so much for watching this Coffee with Z.